High traders S&P 500 rose by 0.3% last week, completing an almost 20% increase in 2017. The market will open on Tuesday and investors expect profits to continue into the Santa Claus rally until January 3rd, but it is likely that the sharp rise this year will prevent the market keep climbing. The tax cut was approved on Friday, another reason for selling into the news pressure. Altogether, I believe that the final week of the year is a wild card. We have the tax sellers and profit taking, and on the other hand, we have the Santa Claus rally and the continued uptrend. Let's have a technical view of the market. When I take a look at the S&P 500, I can see the amazing uptrend since the beginning of the year, up by 19.8%. However, take a good look on Friday. There's a small pullback on Friday, and that came after the news about the tax cut approved. So are we going to get the pressure of the sellers due to the sell or news phenomena, or are we going to see the Santa Claus rally? Again, this is a very, very wild card. It is impossible to predict what's going to happen this week. There's pressure on both sides, and it will be very, very interesting to see what's going on this week. Let's take a look at uh, last week's picks. We had MAC for a long over $66. It moved up by 2.4%, very close to my target. However, sadly, did not reach my 3% target, came down and failed. I never lose more than 3%. My second pick was URBN long. It looks like it was a great winner over 6%. However, it triggered my entry point and then it came down and hit me by 3%. So URBN is another loser, a 3% loser. Let's have two picks for this week. My first pick for the week is Alcoa, long over $50.31, a uh, big uh, aluminum producer in the United States. Uh, the technical formation here looks very solid, very nice uh, cup formation, and I would like to go long if it moves higher. And again, uh, take notice of what the market is going to do, because the market is going to play a very important role in this trade, in any other trade that you take this week. My second pick for the week is SYF long. SYF is looking good over $39. That's a whole number breakout. Very, very nice uptrend. A financial company in the United States dealing with uh, credit cards. One of the biggest expected winners from the tax cuts are financial companies. Uh, so SYF uh, looks like uh, it has a good chance uh, to participate in the rally. Uh, I wish you a great trading week and Merry Christmas. See you next week. Thank you for watching my video. Do you have what it takes to become a trader? I would like to invite you to take my free trading challenge. If you succeed, I will fund you. You will get free access to a $14,000 trading account, which you can trade from home and earn 70% of the profits you generate. No risk, no cost. Just click here and join now. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel here. If you have any questions, please use the comments below.